Midwest Sportsnet is on location today at the NAI Baseball Championship, the opening round Oklahoma City bracket, and I'm Joey McWilliams. I have a chance now to visit with the winning coach from the Mid-America Nazarene Pioneers, Coach Ryan Thompson. Coach, you have made history today, to mm -hmm. say the least. First trip to the NAI World Series as you won three games here in this opening round tournament, and you are going to be moving on. First off, congratulations on the win over the top seed Oklahoma City Stars. Thank you. We, we've been playing Oklahoma City for 10 years. I have so much respect for Coach Gray Ball and his program. Early in our career, we would come down here and play him, and it was just a great benchmark for us, and it's very surreal that, that we won the bracket here because they're just a great program, great coaches, great kids. You come in as the number three seed. You never faced a lower seed during the tournament. You defeated the number two Freed Hardeman Lions with a, a score of 7-6, a one-run game there, a one-run game the next day, 6-5 over Oklahoma City, and then 9-5 here in the championship. So you were playing up, if you will, all the way through. Yeah, it, it was it was a challenge for sure. But it wasn't pretty at times, but our guys just really focused pitch to pitch, won the pitch. I thought our mindset and toughness were excellent, and we just continued to respond right in every situation. And they weren't always pretty, but we got the job done. A couple of one-run wins, then, of course, the four-run win, a big win this afternoon here to take the championship as well. Is there anything that stands out to you about the tournament? I mean, they, they played well. Your pitching was fantastic yeah. throughout. Yeah, we knew our pitching would have to pitch well tired, and I thought our guys did that. Um, they really seemed to slow it down, breathe, control each pitch, and things we've talked about and we're just so proud of how they handled the pressure of this situation. I think some of it goes back to last year. We kind of got there and just didn't do as well as we'd hoped and, and I think we had a veteran group that was understood what we were getting into. All right, last word, Coach, then. Again, congratulations on this. I know you're probably not thinking ahead just yet, but are you wrapping your head around the fact that history has been made? <laughs> no, not at all. Um, but, you know, I'm sure that'll start to soak in tonight. But just so happy for these players, you know, and just the way they competed was excellent. We've grown as a team from start to finish, and we're not the same team we were when we started. We just keep getting better, and that's been our focus. So, I'm just thankful we get to stay together. It, it, seasons are hard when they end, and we don't have to deal with that right now. <laughs> and so I'm thankful we get another two games at least, at a minimum, with this group. So we're just very fortunate that we get to spend more time together. All right, Coach, congratulations, and enjoy the trip to the World Series. It has been a blast from Oklahoma City, the NAI opening round. Eight fun games here. Oklahoma City University has a beautiful campus, a beautiful field. Jim Wade Stadium has been an absolute joy to get to broadcast games from. And so I've enjoyed my time here, but we'll wrap it up from Oklahoma City now. A shout out to everyone involved, including the Sports Information Director here, Rich Tortorelli, and all the folks who, who helped over the course of this week. Congratulations once again to the Mid-America Nazarene Pioneers. The Pioneers prevail here in Oklahoma City and they move on.